Hey, you guys, it's Star. Thank you so much for tuning into the video. So as you can see, we are back at Family Dollar. We got a brand new five off of 25. I was hoping we were going to get one last week because the coupons were so good. But we got brand new coupons today, even though I'm going to be using a lot of the older ones as well. But we are going to be doing an all digital transaction. So no paper coupons. If you don't already have a Family Dollar account and you want to do this deal, all you have to do is download the Family Dollar app or go on the Family Dollar website website, create an account using your email and phone number, download the same coupons that I am going to use, enter that phone number at the register, and you will be able to do this deal. So without further ado, let's go in and see what I can put together. Okay, so before we get started with the 5 off of 25 deal, you know I'd like to show you guys what my store has going on in the clearance section. So I'm noticing a lot of the Glade and Airwick type products on clearance. I really like this right here. This is $3.88. We have a dollar off one paper coupon for that. And then all of these Glade cones looks like they're 80 cents on clearance as well. Got some wax melts in here. I'm just reviewing everything else just to see if they have anything else new. All of those hair products are still there. So a few new things added over to the clearance section as well. And then over here, they have some food type items and they got some cat food on clearance. So take a peek at your clearance section just to see what they added. OK, so the first thing I am going to pick up is one of the family size boxes of Kellogg cereal. So in my store, um, these are four dollars and twenty five cents. I think in some stores they may actually be four dollars, but these are huge boxes. So these are one pound boxes of cereal. I have scanned a few boxes of these and it looks like the Frosted Flakes are attaching to the coupon. The Apple Jacks are attaching to the coupon. For some reason, the Honey Smacks did not attach for me, not to say that they won't work but I'm not going to add those in just because they're not attaching so please scan just to make sure that you have the right box of cereal that's attaching to your coupon and you scan with the app so I'm going to go on ahead and get one of the frosted flakes and one of the apple jacks they're 425 and I am going to use our buy one get one free digital coupon the next item up is one of the Gain Liquid Laundry Detergent. So I'm going to grab one of the 40 ounce bottles. These are supposed to be on sale for $3.95 this week. And then we have a $2 off one digital coupon. Hopefully they ring out for the right sale price because you know we've had some issues. But we're going to use the $2 off coupon on this guy. The next item on my list is the Gain Dryer Sheet. So we're gonna grab one of the 105 count dryer sheets. You can also do the uh, Gain Fireworks that are $5 or the Liquid Fabric Softener if you'd like. I'm gonna grab some of the dryer sheets. They are also supposed to be on sale for $3.95. And then we have a $2 off digital coupon. Next item up is one of the Sparkle Paper Towels, the six packs of Family Rolls. So these are $5 regular price, and I am going to use the $1.25 off of one digital coupon. Last item up is one of the Clorox bleach. We're gonna get one of the 116 ounce to 121 ounce. So these are the big bottles of Clorox bleach. So we have a $1 off one digital coupon. I think I'm gonna grab one of these 121 ounce bottles right here. So now let's review everything that we have. So we have two boxes of the Kellogg's Family Size Cereal. These are $4.25 here. We're gonna use our buy one, get one free digital coupon. We have one of the Gain Fabric Softener uh, dryer sheets. You can also get the liquid or the fireworks. These are $3.95 and we are going to use the $2 off digital coupon. We have one of the Gain Liquid Laundry Detergents for $3.95, and we are going to use the $2 off one digital coupon. Then we have one of the Clorox Big Boys. So these are $3.95. I have a 121 ounce bottle. I'm going to use the $1 off one digital coupon. And then finally, I have one of the Sparkle Paper Towels. They are $5. I'm going to use our 125 off one digital coupon. So this is all of our items. 
Okay, y'all, so that was pretty interesting what just happened. So my five off of 25 did not come off, but it's not for the reason that you think. So when I got up this morning and I was clipping my digital coupons, I noticed that there was two different buy one get one free Kellogg cereal coupons. One said like off of family size boxes and the other one didn't really have like a family size wording there. What I didn't realize is apparently one of those was a store coupon and the other one was a manufacturer coupon. So when I just checked out and he told me what my total was, I thought it was right or maybe just one or two items maybe didn't ring out at their sale price or something I didn't know because I was expecting to pay around ten dollars plus tax which is what I paid my total was supposed to be I think ten dollars and thirty five cents plus tax my five off of twenty five didn't come off and I still paid ten dollars and eighty five cents plus tax but let me tell you why so I downloaded both of those Kellogg's Apple Jacks coupons you can see both of them there there actually came off one of them came off as a family dollar store coupon it took off four dollars and 25 cents the other one came off as the manufacturer coupon taking off four dollars so my total was a little bit higher because that four dollar and 25 cent off coupon came off as a store coupon versus a manufacturer coupon and I did not know that both of them were going to come off at the same time so essentially I just got both of those boxes of cereal for 25 cents because my five off of 25 did not come off so as you can see the gain rung up on sale the digital coupons came up there I got two Kellogg's a cereal coupons coming off there and then the Clorox and the Sparkle. I just quickly tried to look at my other accounts, my other Family Dollar accounts to see if I had both of those Kellogg's uh, coupons available again to download onto another account because I was about to go back in this store and rinse and repeat that and just get me some free cereal. Those, Both of those coupons are gone. There is only one there now. So they must have caught their mistake very very quickly but if you have both of those oh my goodness you can go to family dollar and win use both of them at the same time you can just buy two boxes of cereal and only pay 25 cents y'all that is wild so i feel like i need to go in there and do another five off of 25 deal i still have my five off of 25 coupon loaded to the account but because of that glitch i still only paid 1085 plus tax and like I said my total should have been 1035 had my coupon come off cor the correct way and that cereal coupon didn't glitch so so crazy y'all so still worked out but I thought that that was interesting that those coupons were glitching and they have caught it that quick so let me see I'm gonna look at my account and see do I want to go back in here and do something else Okay, you guys, so I just ran back in here because what I'm going to do is I'm going to rinse and repeat that same transaction that I was supposed to just do on a different account just to make sure that this transaction works well at the register. Um, the only switch out that I'm going to make is I'm going to add in one of these instead of doing the Clorox bleach because I definitely want to pick up this Lysol and then I'll use the $1 off one paper coupon on that other than that it is the same transaction um, as the first one my pre-coupon total I think is $25 and 28 cents okay y'all so transaction number two worked out as planned kind of the only thing that was kind of thrown off let me show y'all my receipt if I can get it together so there's the Kellogg's Frosted Flakes. This time I only had the one manufacturer coupon on there. So that came off fine. It came off for $4. Um, and then I have the gain items there. So the Lysol threw my transaction off a little bit. As y'all can see, that Lysol spray is only ringing out for $2.91. I wish they had some more in there because I'm telling y'all I would take my $1 coupons and kill them. But they only had one that I could see. So that was $1.91. But because that Lysol was was $2.91 instead of $3.88. I had to throw in some filler items to get my total back to $25. So there's the other gain. There is the sparkle paper towels. And those are my filler items that I grabbed at the register. I put in some Nihilators for my son and then a four pack of Wrigley gum. That got me back over to $25. And then my subtotal after my coupons and my $5 did come off this time was $10.85. So 
$1.81. After taxes, I paid $11.95. So not bad this time. I just wanted to make sure that that transaction would actually work. I never want to send you guys to the store with um, without testing things first. So even um, if you just do the first transaction as I have planned, it should work out well. This video, of course, is much longer than my normal videos, but I hope this was helpful for you guys, especially if you have those two Kellogg's coupons. Go in there and get your free cereal. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit that thumbs up button and I'll talk to you soon.